Hey everyone in the Jason Nation, my name is Jason and welcome back to some more Pokemon Insurgents. In the last episode, we actually found out that the Abyssal and the something else called, I don't remember what the other one was, were actually having intentions or had intentions of trying to kill the Augur, but those were soon foiled right after. So, with that being said, I'm going to head back to where I was in the... Or did I end off there? I don't even know where the hell I... No, I ended off there, never mind. I thought I ended off in the cave, but I went back to Telnor, apparently. I don't even remember what happened, because it has been a little bit since I actually... You know what? Hold on a minute. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold the phone here. Hold the phone here. I'll be right back. Alright, so we're back. I just had to change up a couple settings real fast, and I had to make sure everything was working properly. Uh, it is, rest assured, it is now, so we're good. Now, I can use... Which button was it? G, there you go. I can use G to speed up the game now, which is really nice. Uh, but we're not going to use that too much, doesn't really matter. So let's head back into this cave now. Oh, that's what happened. We came into this cave, found out that there was those plans to go down to kill the auger, and then we had to dip on out of here. Alright, that, that's what happened. Now I remember. Alright, let's just run out of here. Uh, I want to figure out... Did I already fight this dude? Yeah, I did. I want to figure out where I'm supposed to go from here. I think I have to go to the other side of the cave in order to get out of here, but I'm not entirely sure. I couldn't tell you. It's been honestly a long time since I played Insurgents. In case you guys didn't know, this isn't my first time doing an LP of Insurgents, but the first time I did it, I only got up to like the 10th episode or something like that, and then I gave up on the game because I just didn't like it at the time. But now I can see that it's definitely changed quite a lot in terms of the gameplay aspects, and it's updated a lot since I last played it. So I was like, all right, we gotta play this game now that it's updated, and I'm loving it so far. Uh, I love the soundtrack in this game too. That is some phenomenal music, honestly. Because I remember playing this game last winter, and I was—I actually listened to the uh, the whole soundtrack for this game that I could find bits and pieces of it anyway. Uh, it was pretty interesting. I, just, I had to try and tear some of it from the game files, which was—it wasn't easy, but you know, it was still interesting. I love listening to it. That, that made no sense. Listening to it because it's just such peaceful like music, especially the cave theme. It's so good. It is so good, dude. Oh my lord. All right. Let's get up on out of here. Also, I forgot to check out that Roselia thing. I still want to check that out. Uh, anything over here? Wow, literally a dead end. That is just booty. All right, well, let's get on out of here, and we're in the Shade Forest still. Okay, true. We can find some Gastlys. I'm not too interested in Gastlys, but whatever. Oh, that doesn't affect Gastly. Missed the attack. Thank you very much. Dead ass Gastly. Alright, well, we're not going to mess with stuff there. I don't want to mess with low-level Pokemon right now. We're on Route 1. What can we catch here? I want to try and catch some stuff that's closer to my level. Maybe we'll start building a team here. Ooh, a Blitzel. Tempting, but I'll, I'll try again. What else can we find here? Just Blitzel, apparently. What else can we find? Ponyta. That's interesting, actually. Uh, okay, so there's Ponyta and Blitzel. We got, like, a Zebra and a Horse. Uh, to be fair, I'd rather have Ponyta, but I want to see if we can get anything else here. Oh, wow, I'm fighting this dude now? Okay, cool. So we got Youngster Taylor, he wants to battle, he's got a Murkrow, he's gonna get murked. Oh, I'm gonna get murked, apparently. Oh! Alright, now if I can not get completely bodied this time, could I find a Pokemon in here that's, uh, that's not Ponyta or Blitzel? Oh, there's more grass up here. Oh, wait, this is, oh god, there's so much grass. I don't know which way to go. Okay, we don't want to get seen by that dude. Alright, what's in here? Blitzel. I might consider catching a Blitzel, but I also really want a Ponyta. Because Rapid Ash would be pretty sick, to be honest. I don't know what I, what I, would, what I would prefer, honestly. Uh, I don't really know. I don't really know what I'd prefer. Sorry, I gotta keep looking over at the camera. Just make sure it's like all, all good and whatnot. I, I feel like those are the only things you can find here. So if we're not going to find anything else, then maybe we'll just have to end up catching one of them. I don't know if I want to catch a Pokemon this early on, though. Maybe I can level like Neil up a little bit and focus on him for now. Because I don't particularly want a Pokemon that I'm not going to enjoy using. Oh, this thing's Fairy-type now. I forgot. God damn it! Oh, we can avoid that guy. All right, awesome. Alright, so we're back. I don't know what else we can find here other than Abra's, Blitzels, and Rapid, or Ponytaws. 
But I guess we're just gonna keep trying to find out here. Because I want to see if I can catch another Pokemon. But I also want to work on Igneal. I'm not sure who I'd rather train up right now. What's going on in this cave? There's a Great Ball up there. There's a dark cave. What does this dark cave do? What is what is so dark about this cave? Because it doesn't seem that dark. Oh, hello. Bo! Minda Garden. What is this? What is this? Hello? Have you visited the trainer school at Minda Town? The ho or they host tournaments that will help trainers learn to battle. Sometimes they even give out prizes. One of the people there, Nora, has pretty much won every tournament. You should try it. Maybe you'll beat her. Maybe we will beat her. Let's go give it a shot at one of these days. Uh, ooh, we can get Nurse Joy to heal our Pokemon here. That's pretty awesome, actually. I will happily take that. My stomach is growling. I need to order me some food after this recording session. Alright, so uh, we have to head to Midna Town. That's the next area to stop at. If I could please stop running into Pokemon, that'd be great. There we go. Okay, so... Come up here, get a great ball, get the greatest of balls, the greatest of balls, and we'll go here, try not to get, there we go, awesome, can I avoid this trainer, I can, awesome, I don't know if I should avoid him though, is there anything new in this grass, maybe I'll go fight that dude afterwards, I'm not sure, nah, no, it doesn't seem like there's anything new in this grass, so it seems like we're stuck with either a Ponyta or a Blitzel. I don't really want either one of them. Not that Rapidash and Zipstrika ultimately aren't good Pokemon. It's just I don't really want to use them in this playthrough. So, Because I think once I get my full team, that's going to be the full team of Pokemon that I'm using. So, Also, how the hell did you poison me if I'm a Steel type? Answer me that one, game. Answer me that one. And an Ariados. This early on in the game? Okay. All right, let's go ahead and heal up, dude. I don't have I don't have a uh, antidote or anything, so this is gonna be interesting. All right, and Twister, kill this Ariados! Wow, it's still alive. There we go. Now we can get out of there. We got 428 XP. Do I take out of? Yeah, you do. Wow, you take damage out of. God damn it. Okay, well we're in Midna Town, so that's all that matters. Let's quick save here. And let's quickly make it to the Pokemon Center before we die. It's over there. It's over there. Oh, survived the poison, but it faded away. Okay, good. I didn't know if you died in this or not. All right, so we'll heal up here. We're in minute time. I do believe the first gym's not here. I don't think the first gym is actually here. I believe the first gym is a couple cities away, actually. I, I think, anyway. I'm not sure. Let's go ahead and into this building. I know there's something important to do in this... In this city, but I don't know where I need to go. Will you trade a Ghastly for my Durant or Heatmore? Bro, I could go back and catch a Ghastly and get a Heatmore. Oh, I'm doing it, boys. I'm doing it. I am doing it. There's the Ghastly we're looking for. There it is. Alright, I need, I need this Heatmore, dude. Pokeballs, got seven. Better get one of these. We did it. I'm gonna get this heat more. Slide that heat. Ah, I was gonna type it. Slide that heat more. Heat more. That's not how you spell heat more. God damn it. Heat. Heat more. Bait. What? Oh, you know what? I'm just naming him a schlong. There you go. Good enough. Hell yeah, I learned Shadow Sneak! Let's do this! Oh my god! Finally a ghost type move! My god, dude. Buizo, get your shit out of here. Oh damn! Igneo's evolving! Igneo's evolving! Look at that. Yo, I can't wait to see how this looks. Yo! 
Dude, that thing looks sick! What the hell? So after returning from that long adventure to go find a ghastly, I have returned to trade you for your heat more, sir. What? So I didn't realize what he actually said. Says, would you like to trade? I'll trade you my gasoline for say a heat more or a Durant. That's a way of getting haunted. I didn't realize that. Or sorry, way of getting Gengar. No. Actually, no, it doesn't even matter. Doesn't even matter. Cause Gengar, yeah. No, that's for Gengar. Well, god damn it. That was a waste of time. Now I have a ghastly named Penis. Alrighty, so, where do we head to now? What the fuck is that? It's a Pikachu taxi! What's up? Call me the Pika taxi guy. My taxi for the low cost of 500 will go wherever you need to go. As long as you've been there before, that is. If you use my service enough, I'll give you a VIP pass that'll let you travel for free. Yes? Oh my god, so you can legit travel anywhere in the region. Bro, that's sick. That's actually so cool. Oh my god, I have to use that at some point. When necessary, of course, I'll have to use that. Dude, that is honestly so cool. What is that? What are those on your head? My favorite fire- ugh, My favorite Pokemon type are fire types. They incinerate the competition. Oh, that's all you have to say. Okay. What about you? I used to work at the first Agra's gym before he disappeared. A lot of people don't know what he was a gym leader too. Oh, well, that's cool to know. I bet this guy right here will be the final gym leader. Probably not. Uh, ooh, Macargo. How's it going, bud? All right, well, I think we're just gonna go ahead and get on out of there. I don't know where the hell we're supposed to even go in Midnight Town. I don't know what our objective here is, but I think we'll, we'll probably find it at one point. Uh, okay, so there's a cave in here. The Midna Mine. What is this? Actually, I think I know what happens in here. Okay, we'll have to come back after this. I don't, we don't need to uh, do this right yet. I think we need to be in here, right here, which is the trainer school. Where's that girl? Where could she have gone off to now? We can't start without her. Well, no need to fear. Jason is here. Why, hello there. Welcome to the Minute Trainer School. I'm the teacher here. I'm hoping to raise young boys and girls to become expert battlers even and even better citizens. If you take classes here, I'll be happy to let you know how it works. Would you like to sign up? Sure, why not? Great, I'll be glad to teach you. We were actually just about to start a tournament between our students. If you want to join, it would be a great way to practice and improve. Unfortunately, one of our students, Nora, seems to have gone missing. We can start the tournament, or we can't start the tournament without her. I'm afraid you'll have to wait. Well, then why did you offer to sign me up? If I had known that, I would have went and found her. But wait, we have to go find her, actually. I'm supposed to find this girl named Nora for this tournament thing. Do you think you can give me a hand? I have no clue where she is. Wait, who am I talking to? What the hell? Okay, so, with that being said, we are pretty much, ex we've explored all of the town. We made it to a new area in the game. This isn't going to be a very long episode, um, but what I want you guys to let me know is I'm going to be bulk recording the next couple of, of episodes. The things I need to let, or uh, things, the, the, the words, they are things that I need you guys to do. First thing is, let me know what's like a good time amount or a good length for each episode. Let me know so I don't like bore you guys and I don't make it too short for some of you. Uh, and also, let me know uh any tips you have for stuff I should look out for. No spoilers, just tips. Just tips and stuff like that. Uh, and yeah, that's gonna be all for now. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Pokemon Insurgents. And in the next episode, we're gonna find Nora and see what's going on down in the mid to mine. Take care.